and we started just going at it. I, I had the camera on the tripod. I said, screw it. And we just went at it right there <laughs> on the on the ground, right on the living room floor. And they, they just kept going on and, you know, going with the webs with the, uh, with their shoot and everything. But then the porn star started getting upset because now some of the guys started coming towards us like they want to join in on the action with me and this girl. So it was kind of like I messed it up for everybody. Hello and welcome to another episode of Storytime. I'm your host, Freddie Shaven. And boy, do I have a great, great, exciting story for you today. I bet you've never heard of anything like this before. I guarantee it. So go ahead and get your popcorn ready, get in the bathtub, or whatever you do when you listen to my videos, and be ready because this is gonna knock your socks off. <laughs> All right, so the year was 2005. I was working in Las Vegas as an escort agent. One of my good friends at the time owned LasVegasGangBang.com. And in the beginning of the 2000s, the membership section and content creation and content exchange was really huge between all the adult entertainers. So one of the porn stars that was coming to the AVN show in Las Vegas, which was every year in January, uh, which is the adult news awards and the show and everything after CES, she wanted to do exchange uh, content with my friend. So he was uh, getting ready to shoot her with a gangbang with eight guys. And that's what they did, right? He had a whole bunch of guys, of course, and they would do scenes with porn stars or whoever wanted to do it. And they'll put that content on their website. And whoever the porn star is will put that content on her website because at the time, uh, people were charging money for membership sections. It's kind of like what they have now with only fans, right? So my friend called me and says, hey, listen, man, I'm in a bind. I need somebody to do the uh, second camera, which is the wide angle, because in a shoot, there's usually two cameras minimum. One is the wide angle and one was the close up. So the close up on the shot, right? So he needed somebody to do the wide angle. I said, yeah, man, I'll, I'll come and help you out because you've done a lot of favors for me and stuff like this. Uh, so I go to his place, I get to his place and the guys were there. There were eight guys. My friend was there. He was gonna do the close sh shoot with the camera. And there was the star who was the porn star. Uh, she was gonna be the star of the video. So she's gonna actually bang eight guys. And then her husband was there, right? He was kind of like her manager, whatever. A lot of a lot of guys in this business, they do that, right? With their wife or whatever. So uh, he was her manager. He was there. And I know to normal people, that's weird uh, that the husband will bring his wife, well, who's a porn star, to come and, you know, F eight guys on camera. But that's the type of lifestyle that we were in, right? So it's perfectly normal, perfectly healthy, right? So anyways, and then they brought with them kind of like a production assistant. She did her hair, her makeup, or whatever she needed, right? She was on set to help her out with whatever she needs, you know? Uh, so it's really, really pretty girl. And uh, so we started to shoot and the, uh, the porn star was in the middle and there was all these guys doing all these different things with her and everything else and things are getting heated and we were in the living room setting and about about 45 minutes or so into the the shoot right i got the wide angle and really with wide angle you really don't really do much you just make sure you have everything is in the frame right and i was on the tripod on one side of the room and my buddy's going around and making sure he gets the the close-up whatever the action is right now i noticed the uh production assistant kept getting closer and closer to me. She was on the floor sitting right next to me and then laying down, then was sitting and we started talking a little bit. You know, we can't really talk too much because, you know, everything is audio and all this stuff, right? So we're looking at each other and uh, and I could tell that she was getting heated, right? She started taking her hand and, you know, reaching down her crotch and she was basically playing with herself. I'm not kidding you. 
So <laughs> about five, 10 minutes later, now it's about an hour into this, uh, this session, right? Into this video. And I looked at her and she looked at me and we just started kissing. I don't even know her name. I don't know anything about her. She was just really beautiful girl, right? And um, she had like a, like a nice, you know, kind of like the picture on the, on the thumbnail. She had like a, kind of like a business suit on with a skirt and everything. And we started just going at it. I, I had the camera on the tripod. I said, screw it. And we just went at it right there <laughs> on the on the ground, right on the living room floor. And they, they just kept going and, you know, going with the webs, with the, um, with their shoot and everything. But then the porn star started getting upset because now some of the guys started coming towards us like they want to join in on the action with me and this girl. So it was kind of like I messed it up for everybody. You know, well, me and this girl did, right? It takes two. So we kind of like messed it up a little bit. Uh, uh, the porn star got a little upset and then her husband got in on the action, started getting upset. <laughs> and <laughs> we had to reshoot, you know, part of the video and everything like that. So it was funny. But yeah, her and I, we, we went at it. We went at it right there on the floor. So uh, I, wish, I wish I could say more. But this is YouTube, and one of these days I'll be able to put this stuff on a on an adult platform where I could speak more fle freely. But you can let your imagination go. You know, here I am with this, you know, hot girl in clothes, and we start going at it. They got the eight guys doing the porn star. My buddy's over there shooting the on the other side with the with the close up angle, and then her husband is in the background over there. Then everybody starts going gravitated towards us, looking at us, what we're doing. And they stop paying attention to the porn star. The video is rolling. And then the husband starts getting upset, like, hey, 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 what's going on? <laughs> and then the porn star was getting mad because some of the guys were, you know, getting away from, from that circle and just getting into what we're, what we're doing. And we're just going at it over here, straight going at it, if you know what I'm saying. So it was fun. I had a great time. I don't know how everybody else you know, felt, but me and this girl definitely had a great time. Uh, my buddy told me that the, the husband was really heated. The girl was kind of heated too, but uh, needless to say, it was great fun and I'll never forget it. So there you go, guys. This is another episode of Storytime. I'm your host, Freddie Shabin. You stay healthy, stay safe, and be happy.